Um, this is an Ares game, Ares game. Anybody say it, whatever. <laughs> Uh, so I, I'll call it Aries game because I'm an Aries sign. Aries game. This model is going to be the AVG 500 that we're going to use. It's a 500 watt supply. It is not modular. It's going to have all the cables built into it. The cables do not remove. Um, so it's not going to be the prettiest build when you think of having modular cables and only using exactly what you need. So that's one of the difficulties there. Um, that said, it's $42 right now. It's $42.99 on Amazon. Uh, decent build quality. They have tier lists for power supplies. It's not going to be in the top tiers, but we're using a hundred dollar CPU with this. We're using the i3 <laughs> CPU. So I'm not going to put, you know, a top tier list power supply on a budget build. That said, you know, they did have some rating issues with a lot of these where they may or may not have reached some of the higher ratings that they were talking about. There's a lot of stickers on them here. If you're worried about the visibility there, I'm going to bring it down a little closer so you guys can see there. So that's the Ares game, 500 watt switching power supply. It's a bronze rated one. Now, you know, obviously I would recommend bronze, not white, if you can see them or higher. Um, the ratings really aren't going to matter unless you're super energy conscious and worried about the energy consumption of this. But overall, a decent power supply to match up with the CPU, and it's going to have some overhead. So, you know, I would be, be interested to actually see how much it runs. So we could plug in our power meter and see how much this whole system runs when we're done. And this is the next choice where you basically have to take this power supply and decide which way you want it to go. Now, if I put it through this way, see how this is upside down? Then on the front side, what you're seeing over there, you're gonna see the 500 watt side peeking through here. See the 500? So some may or may not want that. Now, if you want the brand facing out, you could do it this way. So that's, again, you're showing off the brand of the power supply. Other factors, if you had a lot of heat in this machine, now I don't have a lot of cooling going on. I've got one single fan up here in the rear. Um, I've got another power supply fan here that's gonna draw air in and out. Technically, you want it to go from the front through to the back. So I'm thinking I'm actually probably gonna have it facing down. So I'll install it with the power supply this way. Um, oh, you'll see the 500 watts, but I want that, that fan facing down. And the benefit of that is that it's going to pull air from underneath and shoot it out the back. It's not going to add or subtract from the airflow in the case. But let me know what you think about that. But that's the Aries game. 500 watts power supply we're going to use on this one.